A big effort is underway to make, a San, to make San Francisco more bee friendly after a sudden spike in the die off rate. KPIX 5's Emily Turner shows us the plan to help save some of the city's hardest workers. The world would be a really sad place without pollinators. So today kicks off San Francisco's efforts to become a city more accommodating to the winged sort, specifically bees. Well, I think it's really important for us to think about uh, some of the things that we may take for granted in our community, especially some of our little workers, such as bees. So Supervisor Katie um, Tang sponsored a resolution to make San Francisco a bee city. 100 of San Francisco's gardeners are now all bay friendly certified and will work to plant sustainable bee habitats and hoping to fight against the 44% die off rate of pollinators last year. That is an alarming number and that is calling us to action here in San Francisco to say, whoa, we need to pay attention to these pollinators, to their health. Ask why are they disappearing? And what can we do about it? The Bee City legislation will be introduced Tuesday, but local experts hope the effort to rejuvenate bee populations will become a part of all of San Franciscans' lives. Three things are easy. Buy the right plant, don't use pesticides, and when you have a gardener, ask that they're bay friendly certified. If you're interested in finding out which plants are pollinator friendly, even specific to your neighborhood, you can go to sfplantfinder.org. In the Sunset District, Emily Turner, KPIX 5.